AppSupport is proud to present you DirectUp. With DirectUp, you can upload your ERP-generated order in PDF form directly in our online shop, without any additional costs or efforts. We will show you how to make the initial setup and how to use it regularly. To start, please log into the AppSupport's website with your account. Then click on My AppSupports. Then click on Upload Order, just like you know it from uploading Excel, iDoc or Word files. In the drop-down menu, select the data type PDF. A red framed square appears and now you can either drag and drop your PDF file or select it from your computer by clicking on the red box. When using DirectUp for the first time, the algorithm has to learn where to find the right references within your document. Once you've finished this initial setup, DirectUp will remember the structure of your PDF orders. For future orders, you will not need to enter any information manually. Please remember that DirectUp saves one format per account. If your company has several App Supports accounts, you must set up DirectUp for each account. If you change the format of your orders, you might have to set up DirectUp again. To set up DirectUp, tick the checkbox Toggle Tutorial on the right. First, let DirectUp know where to find the order reference. Click on the Order Reference button and then on the corresponding order number in your PDF. Then click on Next in the tutorial. Next, DirectUp must find the AppSupports article number called Our Article Number. Therefore, click on the button Our Article Number and select one AppSupports article number in your PDF. By clicking on one number, DirectUp should mark the entire column of your article numbers. DirectUp recognizes the AppSupports article numbers no matter if you use them with dots in it, spaces, a prefix of letters or not. If something is not recognized correctly, you can tick the box Toggle Advanced View to make the system add more or delete items. Click Next in the tutorial. Now let DirectUp know where to find the order quantity. Click on the button Order Quantity and then select one quantity in your PDF order. Like the article number, your entire quantity column should be marked now. Then click Next in the tutorial. Optionally, you can also add your internal article number or article designation. For this, please click on Optional Article Reference and mark the according element on your PDF. To check if DirectUp recognized and counted all items correctly, Look at the category buttons you click to select the corresponding field of your PDF. In the end, you should have the same amount of article numbers, quantities and internal designations if selected. When you are done with the setup, click on Add to Cart. You will get a message that the format you have chosen has been saved automatically. Next, you will be redirected to your shopping cart. Depending on the size of your first upload, the redirection to your shopping cart might take a few seconds. Please check your shopping cart before finalizing your order. To finish the order process, click on Order and then follow the instructions. For your future orders, you can now simply drag and drop or upload your PDF file into the red square. Your order will automatically be recognized and parsed by DirectUp and processed to the shopping cart. DirectUp will make your shopping and ordering experience on AppSupports faster than it already is. We hope you find this video helpful and if you need further assistance, please do not hesitate to contact our support team. Thank you.